Glenn Kitchen, and uh, he's our winner this week in GX94 Supper in the Field contest. Of course, we are at uh, week three, halfway through here already in the 2015 edition. First of all, congratulations on uh, being our Supper in the Field winner this week. Thank you very much. How long have you been farming in this area? Well, since about 1978, okay. over 30 years. So it's been in the family? Yes. Okay, tell us about the farm. How big of a farm is it? Uh, well, we used to be have a few, uh, about 1,500 acres in 83, and I lived at a different farm, and my dad passed away in 83. So my mother was here, so I come home for a couple of years, and then I got married, and she moved to town. And We found a hard time getting hired, man, so we let some acres go. And uh, in the 90s, I was into buffalo and cattle, and that maybe didn't pan out so good. So now I'm into grain now, and it built up, we have about a thousand acres now. My son come home, and he's he's a plumber. So he's helping me out now. So, as far as your uh, involvement in the cattle industry, you were you were a little ahead of your time, if I can say that. You kind of missed the the, the good times, and you kind of lit, you, looks like you went through that lean period after BSE. Yeah, yeah, things just didn't work out. I put a went into Buffalo there in '98. We paid some pretty high prices, and I had cattle, and then uh, BSE hit. So that I have a uh, fairly good land. And I took it out of production, so I figured if I wasn't going to make a dollar, I'm going to go back into cropland again. And it, it worked out pretty good because we've had some pretty good crops mm -hmm. in this area. So it's turned out well, but cattle prices are good and good for them. They deserve it after a 10-year beating. Yeah, so you, you do some work off the farm as well? Yes, I work at uh, Mosaic with Enzyme Drilling. We're contracted out. Mm -hmm. So I've been working there for about uh, 11 years now. It works out good. I can take time off for uh, seeding and take time off for harvest, so it works out really good. Okay. So how have you done with your seeding so far this spring? Uh, pretty good. We're about two-thirds done. I have about, uh, got the wheat in, a little bit of canola, and got about 300 uh, acres of canola left. And that should, should be in this weekend. Still lots of time. So certainly a lot better conditions to seed into this year than you've seen probably the last several years. Yes, last year I believe we started May 25th, so and it did come around all right, but Mother Nature will decide in the fall time if we get anything. Hey, you enjoyed your supper in the field? Yes, yes, very much, and I'd like to thank CJGX very much.